सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ एब्स्ट्रैक्ट शेप एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग ब्लेंडर Guys, I'm using cycle render. So click on here and delete all assets like this. And first of all, guys, I'm going to here add and use landscape this one. And in change, guys, presets this one. I change presets like this river. Yeah, and guys, you can also change this one lake. Yeah, it's better. and i also increase segments by segments i like 256 and y axis subdivision y same 256 yeah right okay so now guys i increase scale size so press s letter and increase size like this yeah simple right okay so next one guys go to add again and use torus yeah and guys go to here modifier so guys firstly i'm going to take a this one subdivision surface yeah and viewport level i take like 3 and render i like 5 yeah and next one guys i use smooth deformer this one yeah and increase angle guys angle i like 2 24 yes and again one more time I use simple deformer, and guys, this time angle I like 360. Yes, and axis I like this one. Yeah, that's my abstract shape. Right? See. So guys, select this landscape, this one, and position change. Yes, and select this torus. Go to up. Yeah. See guys, that's my abstract shape. And now, guys, I create animation. So for animation, I go to here. I see that's my rotation animation, like this. I create like this type of animation. So I go to like one second. So guys, click on here, like this, and guys go to like two hundred frames, and this one like three sixty, and press this animation key. Simple, right? See guys, that's my simple animation, and go to back and play. Yeah. That's beautiful, simple, right? Okay, so guys, next one. Again, I take torus, and guys, this time torus segments increase. I like hundred, and segments like fifty. Yeah, and change, guys. This time, little bit change. Yes, and guys, radius more. Like this, I like zero point zero zero five. Yeah, good, right? See, guys, that's my simple shape. Okay, so guys, select this shape and duplicate, and press S letter. Yeah, good. And one more time, duplicate and S letter and increase scale size. Yes, good. So guys, select your all torus, this one, and rotate. Rotate like this. Yes, beautiful guys. Right, see that's my simple composition. And next one, guys, I take camera, camera, and guys go to here view and camera view check and press zero and go to back camera view. Set your camera angle like this. Yeah, go to little bit back. Yes, it's good. Yeah. And guys, uncheck this camera. Yeah. So press zero letter. That's my camera angle. It's good. So go to zero frame and play. Good. Okay. So guys, last one. I take more landscape. So this time, landscape presets change like this. Second one, mountain one. Yeah. And increase subdivision two five six and. Two five six, yeah, and increase size. So press S letter, increase like this, 
and go to back here and guys scale size increase as that up yes and guys go to camera yeah better and one more time duplicate and go to back guys rotate your landscape randomly and again zero yes yeah see guys that's my final composition that's my simple shapes and composition and next one guys i create material so guys go to shading yes and see guys that's my shading right okay so guys firstly i create material for this one shape and create new material yeah and next one guys i use mix material so shift a and use mix material that's my mix shader and connect with mid one yeah so guys this time this one bdsf so connect with third one like this yeah and next one i use emission emission this one yeah so guys select your animation connect with shader like this and color guys color take anyone but i like orange color so orange 0.024 and 1 yes and strength i like guys take 40 yeah it's good right okay so next one guys i apply displacement so so shift a and use displacement select this one and guys connect with this one displacement map select this displacement map connect with here like this and next one now i apply color ramp so use color ramp yes and select this color ramp first of all connect with mix material so guys select your color ramp connect with this one mix material third one yes and change guys position color so this one select your black color and so black color 0.2 yeah and white color this one select your white checker box and position i like 0.27 yes simple right okay so and next one guys select your color ramp and also connect with this one height and mid level guys i like 0.6 and scale i like 1 0.1 yeah see guys that's my some note editor and next one guys i use ronnie fracture tool so shift a and use ronnie fracture this one and guys connect with this one color ramp so guys select your color and connect with this one yeah and guys again shift a so this time i use wave wave texture so select this vector yeah and change guys y axis yes and guys now so guys this time i use mapping so press ctrl t and second option is press a letter and use mapping mapping and connect with vector like this yeah and last one guys use texture coordinate select your texture coordinate this one and connect with uv so guys select your coordinate and connect with uv like this yeah beautiful guys see that's my beautiful shader effect this one that's my beautiful shader i create abstract shape and now guys next one i create next one color this one so guys this time same use color ramp select your color ramp so connect with here base color select this one and color change guys color this one i like guys take any color is dependent your work i like 
like pink color and also this one pink yeah it's beautiful and guys you can also change more shader like red so go to on this one checker box and color like red yeah it's good and again i take one more color so select your this one checker box fourth one and change yeah much better and go to here i like pinkish color yes beautiful guys see that's my beautiful abstract shape and beautiful material right it's really beautiful and guys go to here so next one guys i use bump effect so go to render setting and guys change render engine i use cycle yeah and device i use gpu yeah and guys go to material so setting and guys see that's my displacement map to use displacement and bump yeah and save your project guys that's most important part like tutorial simple and save yeah and click on here yeah that's my beautiful material and beautiful abstract shape right see that's my beautiful effect right okay so guys go to here and preview uncheck go to last this one and color i like black environment black and go to back and press zero for camera preview yes really good right it's really beautiful okay so next one guys i create material for this ring simple so select this one ring and create new material so use animation and take any color like pink color like this and strength i like 20 and this one i like blue color animation 20 blue like 0 0.6 yeah and one yeah and last one you can take any color like this time i use orange color so animation and orange like this strength 20 yes good right okay so guys see that's my beautiful shape and material and next one guys i create material for this one landscape this one that's my landscape yeah so create new material and guys base color i use black like this and guys now next one i use color ramp color ramp yeah so guys position that's my black color position i change i like 0 0.5 and this one i like 0 0.45 yes and guys connect with roughness this one roughness so connect with here yeah and guys select your color ramp and shift d duplicate yeah and this time i use bump so guys select your color ramp connect with height and this bump connect with normal map this one normal yeah and strength i like two yeah good okay so guys next one i take noise texture this one noise texture and guys connect with face this one and select same face connect yes and guys scale size i like 15 and detail 15 good it's good and guys now i change also this one color setting so position change guys black position this one i like think 0 0.25 yeah and white color i like 0 0.5 yes see guys that's my beautiful material this one beautiful flow material it's good so go to camera and yeah good right okay so now guys you can also change this 
material some position setting scale size change is dependent on your work so 15 is good for me yeah good okay so last one guys i create material for this hill this one mountain and guys simple use dark gray guys roughness decrease specular decrease yeah right simple and apply same like this and apply this one yes beautiful guys right see that's my final one that's my final material and click on here render preview yeah it's beautiful guys and save your project yes and now guys my, my final material is finished go to layout and yeah and guys last one i use light so for light use area light so go to up and rotate this light rotate like this like 90 and go to back yes and guys i change some setting on light so shape i use this and power i like 50 and color use blue color blue color yeah so select your area light and duplicate so apply on this side and guys rotate your light rotate like this yeah it's good little bit up yes and go to camera preview yeah it's beautiful guys right that's my final work and guys position change landscape like this that's my landscape and guys little bit rotate next one this one yeah it's good yes good right okay so next one guys go to render setting that's my final work and guys render setting go to here cycle and support is good render guys use 256 for fast rendering guys you can take also 128 if your system qualification is better you can increase max amp otherwise decrease and yeah all is good sir simple guys right okay so guys go to here that's my final render i really like this material and shader and guys go click on here save your project so go to render and render image check see guys that's my final work it's really beautiful guys right okay so guys now i apply really cool glow effect so close your setting and go to compositing and use node check so guys firstly i use clear select your glare and connect with image to here and use view angle view select and image connect with this one yeah and guys medium to use high and use fog glow and size guys use 9 is good yeah it's beautiful so guys go to again render and guys full frame and use view node yeah beautiful guys right see guys it's my beautiful shape and beautiful material guys i really like this effect right okay so guys that's it that's my final work it's really beautiful so guys if you like my video please share and subscribe to my channel thank you